Fox, sponsored by the Magnificent Seven in theaters, September 23rd, rated PG-13. Blue trunks for Paige Van Zandt, white trunks for Beck Rawlings. Beck Rawlings is expecting Paige to want to close distance and pressure. It feels like that will really walk right into Beck striking in her game plan. However, when I spoke to Paige, she said the game plan early is the kick actually had a, a significant break for Dancing with the Stars. Which did lead to a shortened training camp. She said she just missed the grind of being a fighter. And I asked her if the fame got to her at all. And, you know, she said training in Sacramento is great because it's just an area where she doesn't have people coming to the gym trying to see her all the time. It's really... Go, no, right hand, right hand, go. Don't wait. She comes forward to right hand. Eric Del Fierro, the leader at Alliance one, MMA, two. one of the best in the business. One, two, three, two, back. Jessica Penny, also in the corner of Ron. Hey, you back. You, don't let her get offensive. We don't have to move back. We don't have to move back. And, and, you know, the game plan of Paige oh, may have taken off. Best combination of the night so far for Paige Van Zandt. Very nice. 15 seconds. Superman punch lands for Rawlings, and again, Paige able to counter. Final seconds of round number one of this strawberry fight. But don't get caught up in the stop, people, the jump. Don't, don't engage in that. Get in, get out, do your damage. And, and the junk, he wants her to get away from some of these flying and spinning techniques and get more down to more traditional combinations. That she oh, oh, she rocked her on cue. Looking to finish this fight. It is all over.